My name is Dr. Stuart Titus, and I'm the President and CEO of Medical Marijuana Incorporated. Today, we are here to celebrate our company's 10-year anniversary. There has been so much progress in the cannabis industry over the last 10 years. It's been a blessing to make an impact on this international movement that is helping so many people around the world. Take a look back at the top 10 moments of the last 10 years from our family of companies. The Medical Marijuana Inc. story begins in March of 2009 when we became the first company entirely within the cannabis business space to be traded on public stock markets. This was an important milestone in the mainstream acceptance of the cannabis industry. There are now over 50 publicly traded cannabis companies on the U.S. markets. In 2012, we launched the first nationally available CBD products in the U.S. with the Dixie Botanicals line. For the first time, consumers could enjoy the benefits of CBD from hemp. In 2012, few people had ever heard of CBD and the health benefits it could provide. As people experienced remarkable results from CBD oil, it became recognized as one of the most beneficial health supplements available. Now, seven years after first sales, the U.S. market for CBD is projected to continue to grow to $22 billion by 2022. Medical Marijuana Inc. portfolio company Canalife Sciences was awarded the first licenses to use the U.S. government's patent on cannabinoids patent 6630507, cannabinoids as antioxidants and neuroprotectants. The company is using these licenses to develop cannabinoid-based pharmaceutical treatments for a pair of neurological diseases, hepatic encephalopathy and chronic traumatic encephalopathy, the degenerative brain disease discovered in many NFL football players and other athletes who experience head trauma. Using their licenses on the government's cannabis patent, Canalife Sciences developed a novel CBD-like molecule, KLS-13019. Measurements show this synthetic cannabinoid is 50 times more potent and 400 times less toxic than natural CBD. Canalife intends to use this molecule to address neurodegenerative diseases like Alzheimer's disease, Parkinson's disease, and Huntington's disease. Deepening our pharmaceutical portfolio, we took a significant position in development stage pharmaceutical company, Axum Biotechnologies. The company has since been awarded the patent for chewing gum as a delivery method for cannabinoids, which is poised to be a major product category for both medical and adult use cannabinoids. Using this technology, Axum is in the midst of pharmaceutical product development, targeting multiple sclerosis, nausea, restless leg syndrome, and drug-induced psychosis. By 2014, word of the benefits of CBD had traveled around the world. In Brazil, where there previously was no distinction between marijuana and hemp, we worked directly with local patients and their families in a grassroots effort to help them access real scientific hemp oil CBD products legally. After an historic court ruling and a class action lawsuit, the country's health authority approved our CBD oil products as prescription medications for conditions like epilepsy, Alzheimer's disease, and Parkinson's disease. Brazil now fully subsidizes real scientific hemp oil, CBD oil, as part of the country's health care program. Our subsidiary, HempMeds Brazil, now supports thousands of families through a network of hundreds of doctors around the country. Two years later, we were able to help patients in Mexico secure the first ever official certificates of import for real scientific hemp oil, CBD oil products in the country. Like in Brazil, Medical Marijuana Inc. worked with families and patients in Mexico to petition the government for access to CBD through a new subsidiary, Hemp Meds Mexico. In order to fulfill Mexico's regulations and ship our CBD oil to patients, we developed the first ever THC-free hemp oil product, RSHOX. Acceptance of our CBD products was a catalyst for cannabis reform in Mexico, leading to the legalization of medical cannabis and the loosening of regulations on access to CBD. Hemp Meds Mexico now supports thousands of families around the country and partners with hundreds of doctors. 
Later that same year, Medical Marijuana Inc. began shipping CBD oil products to a third Latin American country when RSHO became the first CBD product to be approved by Paraguay for import. Through our expansion efforts in Central and South America, over 300 million people gained legal access to CBD. In 2017, Medical Marijuana Inc. subsidiary, Hemp Meds Mexico, became the first company to address the United Nations and World Health Organization about CBD. Hemp Meds Mexico President, Raul Elizalde, spoke at the 39th meeting of the Expert Committee on Drug Dependence to discuss CBD's benefits and lack of psychoactivity and share his own family's experience with CBD. Based on the testimony of Raul and other experts, the World Health Organization confirmed the safety and health benefits of CBD. Medical Marijuana Inc. subsidiary Canaway, the first cannabis company to use the direct selling model, expanded operations into Europe officially celebrating its grand opening in 2018. The company now ships its products to 35 countries, including throughout the U.S., nearly all of the European Union, and various territories in those regions. As part of Canaway's expansion efforts, the company worked with European regulatory authorities to educate them on CBD and create regulations. Nothing is more important to us at Medical Marijuana, Inc. than bringing the benefits of cannabinoids to those who need it most. That's why we're so proud to work with ECHO as our official charitable partner. With help from donations from the Medical Marijuana, Inc. family of companies, ECHO Connection has been able to assist over 100 families with product donations totaling nearly $1 million and growing. Thank you for following along with Medical Marijuana, Inc.'s first 10 years. As we look back at all the lives we've touched, we know that we couldn't have done it without our investors, employees, customers, and partners all around the world. We work hard to make progress every single day, and just this year, we're proud to have become the first company to have CBD products listed in the prescriber's digital reference, also known as PDR, and to have been among the first companies with CBD products certified by the U.S. Hemp Authority. We could not be more excited for what's to come for Medical Marijuana, Inc. and the cannabis industry.